eat. I, I, I don't understand. <laughs> this one, you, you start by kissing me. <laughs> what is your plan in this place? <laughs> Tell me why you are doing this because I know you have the motive. Well, actually, there is this my friend. Hmm? Though they lost their parents. It's just them alone. They don't have a place to stay. So please, I want to know if you just allow them to stay here for like three days. So they will look for where to stay. Please. Don't you understand that we have only one room? We, we are managing one room. We manage. See, this is my privacy, you know? Please. I don't think I can accept that. Maybe I understand. I understand you perfectly. Please, it's just for three days. Maybe you don't understand. You know, I, I, I love you so much, and uh, you know, I believe you believe that I can do everything to make you happy. But to invite anybody, any visitor to come and stay here, you no, know, I can't afford that. I can't. How can you invite a person? And you are talking about them. That means two persons. No, no, no. I can't afford that. No, no, I'm sorry. Baby, please. Come on. You know I love you so much. Don't say no. Please. Baby, please. Just three days. Please. Why are you doing this? Can't you see? Look at where I'm staying. I understand. Hmm? Just well, I, I, for three days. Come on. Please. Don't you say you love me? Hmm? Baby, I love you. Know, but I'm finding it very difficult to say yes. Mm. You, you women, you women. No worry, you're not gonna stay more than three days. Please, let the three days be three days. Three days. Yeah? Just because I love you. Hello, Nene. What's up? How are you? Okay, so where are you now? Okay, start coming. Just get your things ready and start coming, okay? Yes, he accepted. I told you. I told you my husband is a nice person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, oh my god. Start coming, start coming. We have a lot to discuss, okay? No, no, no. You have nothing to worry about. Don't worry, okay? Alright, alright. Waiting. <laughs> Oh my god. Once again, you're welcome to my house. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. God bless. Amen. Amen. It's okay. Frank. Present. I would like you to get a job. Yeah. At least to get busy, you know? To get a little income in case you want to buy something for yourself, okay? Sure, sure. I really appreciate that. And please remember. True. I told my husband three days. Yeah. I told him just three days. Yeah. So you have to hurry up and get something doing, okay? Yeah, that's what I'm planning on. But, um, I still thank you. It's not easy for you to try to accommodate the two of us here. I appreciate it. It's nothing. Thank you so much. Uh, um, yeah, it's honorable. I'm sorry. I'll call you back. Uh, I'll call you back. Thank you very much. Mr. Honorable. <sighs> so, so you're welcome. Thank you. Thank you very much, sir. Uh, you know, my wife told me about your coming. So, you know, I wouldn't have said yes. What would a man do when we may interfere? So I don't have to say no. Thank you. Thank you so much, sir. Honestly, everything I heard about you was true. You're such a nice man. 
My God in heaven will bless you. Amen. 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 Okay. It's okay. It's alright. It's alright. Um, young man, how are you? I'm fine, sir. Okay. I hope you, are, you have finished your education. Oh? Yes, sir. Sorry. I'm just looking forward. Okay. Thank you. Thank you so much, son. Thank you. <laughs> Baby. Thank you very much, okay? Thank you. Baby. Baby. See, I'm sorry. How many times do you want me to apologize? I've, thought, I've been doing that the past two weeks or so. I'm sorry, babe. Alright? You and I know that you're the only person that's got on my heart. And the fact that you actually lived the way you left is getting more worried. And I seriously do want to come back. You want me to come back? Of course. On what condition? At what? On what condition do you want me to come back? That I truly love you and you know that. You want me to come back when you have a girlfriend? Jeez, that has got nothing to do with this. Alright, okay, listen, listen. If it's about the girl, seriously, there is nothing between both of us. And I promise you I'm going to take her out of the picture, right? I'm going to take her out of the picture. Damn. <laughs> You know I can't stand you with another woman. We've got nothing in common. You are the only person that's gotten my heart, and that's what matters, alright? I love you and you love me and that's all that counts. Alright? And I seriously do beg for you to be a Angel. Yes, Dad. You know I love you. You know I can do everything to make you proud. You see, um, the reason why we are here is for us to talk about this your so-called friend. I'm I'm not I'm not I'm not comfortable. We are for her to stay in our house. One room. Baby, I thought we've talked about this before, huh? Oh, we, we talked about it actually, yeah. Try right. to understand the situation. Try it. Eh? See, this is a family. Come eh? on, Kunda, it's okay. It's Baby, it's okay, okay? Please, please. It's I, okay. Please, I beg you, I beg you. I beg you, it, it cannot work. It cannot work. Can't you see she's giving us uncomfortable? Can't you understand that? I'm a married man for crying out loud. Baby, I know. I just, just give her some time, okay? I'm the only person she has right now. I can't throw her away. I can't I can just let her go. Please. Just give her some time. Maybe, who knows, she might get married or get a better accommodation. Please, I beg you. Please. No, please, no, no. Uh, no. Don't please me. Uh, have you forgot that I'm a married man? I need my privacy. I understand, but please.
should have a key, a point. You should have a point where you can nail your husband. It's not like I'm using something on him or... It's just a way, the way you understand, you make him to understand you. Okay? It's not a big deal. What I told you is a nice person. It's just cool, we slept. Even the way he wore condoms. Oh my god. Ah, it's such a nice person. That's my husband for you. Thank you. My way over. <laughs> How are you doing today? Where is everybody? She actually... Okay, but it seems, okay, I called my wife and uh, she told me she is, was going to meet you. Just come, alright? 
Stop! What? What is it? No, am I just budging any time, man? Please. Are you serious? Yeah, I value my life. Please. Please. Let go of me. Please. No, let me go. What the fuck? Oh. I don't understand. I mean, I really don't understand. Well, what is it that you don't understand? I'm telling you, you're endangering your marriage. Don't forget, it's your matrimonial home we're talking about here. You really need to secure it. In fact, you must secure it. I understand. Eh? As a matter of fact, a lot of people have been saying the same thing. But I want you to understand that I'm just helping her out, okay? Moreover, she's not gonna stay forever, okay? Don't worry. Come on, cheer up. I'll handle it, okay? Mm -hmm. okay. Come on, cheer up. No, no. I'm willing to ask you something. What is it? Do you have anything to do with Prodenaka? Prodenika? Yeah. Nothing. No. What is it? Are you sure? Because I've been hearing rumors around the compound. Everything you've heard, they are all lies. Okay. What, what sort of rumor did you hear? That you and Brother Mecca have secret affairs. That's why I said I should ask you to be very sure. Like as you said, they are rumors and they are all lies. Forget about those people, huh? Well, I just said I should ask. And, um, you know, we are staying in someone's house. So I think the best thing to do is just for us to, um, like, take things easy and so we get a better place. Okay? Yeah. Can we do that? Please. So, how is the job thing? Man, uh, I'm, 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 I'm still searching. I'm still searching. I hope uh, God will do it. Have you eaten? Hey, I've begged you countless number of times. I want to come and see you. I want to know where you stay, alright? I want to know the people you're with and how you're faring. That's just what I'm begging for. And I've told you I'm comfortable coming to see you here and in your house. He's a family man. Listen, listen, listen. Alright? I never said you're not comfortable coming to see me around here, alright? Listen, I want to talk to you as to art. This is a public place, alright? And the aspect of the family man stuff, are you sure there's something you're hiding from me? 
like honestly, are you sure there's something you want to tell me? I don't me? know how to place it. Yeah. I should be suspecting you have a motive because I, yes, yeah, serious. you want to come, you want to come, but you should have a Jeez. motive. Hell no. You want to come. You want to come. Days I begged you. It's over. No, please. I just want you to give them some more time. Give them more time to get a place to stay. Please. Well, you know, there is nothing you ask. I can do. As far as you are the one that ask, you must receive. <laughs> okay. Thank you. Uh, you know, I, as I speak to you now. My wife traveled to her village. Are you serious? I'm on God. <laughs> well, I traveled to her place, so there is no way she can find that. I love you. Me too. Wait. Let me. I speak to you right now, I sent my wife to village for an important message. Wow. So I have you all to myself. Of course, yes. I can't wait. Mm. <laughs> mm. Mm. Wait, Angel. Time. I've told you a couple of times, I don't want to see you anywhere close to that girl. The next time I see you close to that girl, I'm going to make this one so small for you to breathe in it. Ma, you've got gold. What is wrong with you? I'm telling you for the last time, I don't want to see you close to that girl again. Hey, girl. Don't make me repeat myself. Hey, listen, man. Listen. <laughs> you know why I come down for you to talk? I don't want to give a fuck what you have to say about that. Please. Anytime I set my eyes on you, around that girl, I will destroy your life. You are threatening me. Hey, not threatening, but 
a promise. Just a promise. Jeez. Listen. I don't want to see you with that girl any longer. <laughs> Jeez. I don't want to see you with that girl any longer. You're threatening me. If you lose, you will hate what you do. Don't worry. It's a promise. Don't worry. Not in this town. In this town. Don't worry. Honestly, I don't know what to do. My husband wants her out of my house. Eh? I don't know what to do. I'm so confused. Don't you think it is time for you to tell him the truth, Anne? You know I cannot tell him the truth now. No! And why, why won't you do that? Because it's too early. You think so? What do you want me to do? Eh? I'm so confused right now. I'm confused. I feel like I'm betraying him, you know. Just tell him the truth. I wonder how he's gonna feel. I wonder how he's gonna take it because Emika loves me so much. He loves me. That's the reason why she tell you. <laughs> and then he'll start dealing with it before it gets too bad. Anyway, it's okay. What will I do now? Eh? You just have to. <laughs> what about your <laughs> Tell me, when is it coming? I'll tell you when I'm ready. See next. Babe, I don't understand. What is what is going on between you and the maker? What affair are you having with the maker? I've told you, I have nothing with a maker. But rumors are everywhere like you're dating this guy. It's all speculated around like you're dating this guy. What is going on? This guy came to me telling me ranting for me to back off from my girl. Listen. Emika accommodated me. And so? Can you allow me to talk? Talk, let me listen, talk. Emika accommodated me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the fact is, his wife is my friend. I know, I know. <laughs> so, 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 what's this news everywhere that I'm with Emika? And you want me to believe you have nothing with Emika? That's what you need to know. I have nothing. Because people, I don't understand. I don't understand what is the speculations around that you're dating this guy. The other day he was he was ranting like a bulldog, telling me to back off. I mean, back off from my girl. What does that mean? What does that insinuate? Babe, I don't understand. If it's about me, I've told you, I've begged you. Do you want to believe me, or you want me to have to what I've told you? Of course, I'll believe you because because it hurts me. I have nothing to do with It's alright. 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 So, 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 so. What is happening to me? Am I falling for a maker? Who is married to my friend? <sighs> but David is still single. But he's a cheat. I'm so confused. I'm so confused. I don't know what to do. Oh, uh, no. I think you're spending your time. I'm talking to Joe. Wow. Huh? Joe? Yes, sir. Who? And they gave us accommodation. Wow. So, I'll be leaving this evening. Oh. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. So, how is your sister? I think I've not seen her. She's okay. Oh, uh, I saw her some minutes ago. She accepted her friends from work. Okay. okay. Yes, sir. Um, all right. Um, when you are leaving, like, in the evening time, just 
Let me know. 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 Everything we, do. we don't have a privacy any longer, so I decided to have that three rooms apartment, apartment for us to be, you know, so that she can have a room. We can have one. anything we want to do. We want to be. <laughs> for my husband. What? Five years. Five, four years. No issue. <laughs> Baby, I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Um, I don't understand. Oh, I you, know. You plotted I, this. I don't get it. <laughs> I'm so sorry. All because of David. David is because of my misfortune. It's because of my predicament. He took away the joy of motherhood from me. Boy, boy. Who was David? The same David you know. My David. Her David. My David! It's no. It's not true. What? <laughs> years ago, many years ago, before we got married, he is my lover. Then I became pregnant for him. During the time of my delivery, I had complications. In order to save my life, the doctor advised that, that my womb would be removed. For me to leave. After all these years, I've been living with the pain in my heart. 
The pain that I will never ever be a mother. All because of that David. I'm so sorry, my husband. Thank <laughs> you. 